Let go, I need your help. We're just trying to help, buddy. Looks like you need some. Joe! Bro, I think my leg is broken. What happened? It looked like I slipped on buying a few. This wasn't there before. The 200 is littered with these freshmen. No, dude, it just wasn't there just a second before. Someone did something perfect. It's hurt too much. I can't stand. Avenge me, brother. Joe, wake up. Joe, I'll avenge you, Joe. Whoever did this to my friend is going to pay. Joe. Hey, do you have the footage? Yeah, it's right here. I just need to load it into the computer. <laughs> what the heck? It's empty. What do you mean it's empty? Let me get a look. Are you sure this is the right memory card that we used? There's nothing on this one. Yeah, that's right one. I did just what the teacher said. I recorded all the scenes and then formatted the card. You idiot. Formatting is the right thing. You only format before we start recording. What about the scene you guys shot with my friend getting hurt? It's been erased. What do you mean erased? We don't have anything to show you. My only lead for the banana peel is gone now. What am I going to do? No. Wait a minute. I think there's a way to get the footage back. What are you talking about? I have a friend who knows how to recover lost computer files. I hope you're right. Let me talk to my friend Mike. I'll get back to you guys tomorrow. Tom, how's your friend Joe doing? He's in a better place now. Oh my gosh, did he die? No, he's got moved to a private room at the hospital. So I have uh, good news and bad news. Spit it out. The good news is my friend Mike can recover the files. That's great. The bad news is that he's asking for $100 in cash. I can come up with 50 bucks, but it's going to take until tomorrow to get the money. I'll come up with the other 50 since I need it for my masterpiece. Hey guys, this is Mike. Did you get her files off the memory card? I'm not doing anything till I get the money. Okay, your money's good. What do you mean, whoopsies? Were you able to get the files? Uh, no. What do you mean, no? Instead of, instead of recovering the files, I made sure to delete them permanently, and no one, not even the NSA, can get it back. Are y'all setting me up? You lost my 50 bucks and you lost the files. Uh, I don't want any cause any problems, so here's your money back. Thanks, but no thanks. I still don't know what happened to Joe. You guys have been a waste of time. Wait, 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 here's your money. Hey man, I'm really sorry about yesterday. I didn't know we were gonna get into that. Don't worry about it, bro. It's not your fault. I'm just upset that my leads are all dead now. I don't even know if I'll avenge Joe. I think I have something that I can help. I found a video yesterday of Joe falling. I don't know whoever recorded it, but they aren't in the video. They don't say anything or show their face. Oh my gosh, Josh, that's Edmund. Look at the watch. The only person I've seen with a watch like that is him. Oh, you're right. What should we do? I need to confront him. It's time to avenge Joe. Edmund should be in Studio 104. Let's head out. Joe, what are you doing here? The doctor cleared me up. She leaves the hospital. I thought I should pay my friend Edmund here and visit. You knew Edmund did it? How? 
I suspect him from the beginning, but I have no evidence, so I start to drop my submission. He always tells my friend in general. Wow, I never knew there was a side of Edmund. How'd you know he was going to be here, though? He come to room 104 every day at lunch. I thought I should come from him by myself, but I saw you guys coming, so I started decide to do eye drop. Sweet revenge! Man, I wish I could have seen that. You can't. Darn it, would have gotten away with it if it weren't for you two. It's just that the saying goes, Q lives by the banana, Q dies by the banana.